owners are trying everything they can to make customers feel comfortable, especially during the pandemic. One business is taking that idea to the next level and offering classes for fully vaccinated people only. 11 Allies, Natisha Lands, talked to the owner about that decision. As Sacred Thread Yoga in East Atlanta Village tries to recover from its pandemic losses, it's reaching out to its community, hoping to pull them back to the mat. Starting next month, the studio will offer vaccinated yoga classes where admission will require proof of a full COVID vaccination. This is a great way for us to address some of the hesitancy. So far, 90% of the Sacred Thread community says they will get vaccinated. Open classes will still be offered to those who have not received a shot. The studio reopened in May, but lost 80% of its revenue and had to close its second location. We are finally getting to a place of coming full circle where the idea of going into a room with other people and sharing space doesn't feel so scary. The studio's decision hits on a debate brewing on a national level over vaccine passports, government issued cards or smartphone badges that show someone is fully vaccinated. The idea is to bring some normalcy back to those who are fully vaccinated, but experts say a federal vaccine passport raises some ethical concerns. Creating two classes of people, one with privilege, one without. And because of the way in which vaccination trends happen in our country, the one without tends to be poor, tends to be more people of color. Right now, the passports are still just an idea in the U.S., but airlines have at least asked the White House to look into them. Meanwhile, Wolpe says using vaccination cards could become a tool for some businesses like Sacred Thread to help protect public health.